when you got star players on your team like Boo FC does, the media starts coming up with a lot of rumors. Bale's coming to Boo FC. This is happening. That's happening. But I saw something in the media that shocked me. What the? Boo FC is a fake? They play on amateur? Boo FC is doing it on professional. This isn't legendary. That's what the media's saying. So what you're telling me is this nice roulette into a beautiful shot that was on professional. So it really didn't happen. What about this long shot? That's an amateur goalkeeper. AA9 skills is a fraud. Booyah FC is just a fantasy. They've beaten everybody on professional. Well, that's what the media is saying. So I said, you know what? Let's go into the game against Montenegro. And let's go see if the game's really on professional or amateur. It says legendary. Is the game lying to me? Possibly. This could still be fake. We got to see how this game goes down first. Can Bowie FC win on legendary? So I said, you know what? This time I'm going to let it load completely. You seeing me warm up in the arena, doing a couple skill moves, having a little bit of fun. Maybe the media is right. Maybe Booyah FC is just a fake. Maybe it's just a fairy tale. Maybe what they've done has been a lie. Why Booyah FC? Why would you do this to us? Montenegro, 14 minutes in. BAM! Booyah FC's a fake! They suck on Legendary! They're not even that good! Oh wait! Via! It's in the back of the net! Is Booyah FC the real deal? Maybe they're not a fake! Maybe! Just maybe! The media was making up rumors! AA! Off the post! They're a fake! He can't even finesse it on Legendary! It's not true. Oh, wait. Booyah FC wins. Booyah FC wins. Now what will the media say? I don't know. But I hope the media understands now. We won 2-1 to one against Montenegro. And I said Wales is up next. And I was reading in the media. They said skills. Get bail. Get gigs. Wales has good player. You have to play them two more times. You got to get their starters. So that's what we're going to do. We play Wales two times. But first, the first game. The finesse off the post. 22 minutes in. And again, skills. 45th minute. It's a penalty, ladies and gentlemen. AA9 skills is going to the spot. Black's the one that took us down. Wait, it's Via. Via to the spot. The superstar takes AA9 skill spot at the penalty and he puts it into the back of the net. 43rd minute. Wales, they're in. The cross, the chip, it's in. Ah, it's all tied up. Can Bully FC do it one more time? Can they win again? Can they keep the winning streak alive? We go into extra time, ladies and gentlemen. 94th minute, AA crosses it in, David Villa into the back of the net, David Villa, the man is a legend for our team, but in the 98th minute, Wales ain't done, it's a sweaty, and it's all tied up, which means, we are going to penalties, what will the media say about this, the first one's in the back of the net, David Villa, to the spot, it's in the back of the net, Wales is back up, what can they do? Ha <laughs> ha, they hit the post. Booy FC is going to win again. They're going to do it again. Son of a booya. Calm down, calm down. It's not over yet. Wales, it's 1-1. One one. It's in the back of the net. 2-1. to one. Wales is up. Booy FC the spot. A9 skills. The legend is in. It's 2-2. Two to two. It's all tied up. Petacek needs to do something. He misses. How did he not save that? Unlucky. We put it in. It's all tied up. 3-3. Three, three. Booy FC to the spot. Oh no, Wales, just kidding. They score. Ha <laughs> ha, Wales scores. Now it's Booy FC. We score. Woo. Will they finally miss? Is this the moment? Shouldn't have faked it, my man. That goes over and it's all on. It's all on Jerome Breda's back. 
the Portuguese man to the spot, and it's in the back of the net. Boo UFC celebrates again. We've done it again. We've knocked off Wales for the second time, which means we get one of their substitute players, and it's a 67 striker, so I say, you know what? I ain't keeping that, man. So, after beating Wales, we unlock the road to England. We will definitely be playing England. But before we play them, we will face Wales one more time. Because if we beat them, we have a chance at getting the legend bail. He is an absolute wonderful player. So I would love to have him on my team in the first minute. Boom! AA9 skills off the post. Unlucky. But then, nine minutes in, Via on the ball, the cross in, AA, it's in the back of the net. Nice cross there from Via. AA puts the sweaty header into the back of the net, and Wales is losing. Now, I'm going to let this clip kind of play a little bit so you can see our attacking play throughout this couple of minutes right there keeper with the wonderful save AA has a chance here he hits the post Wales they clear it but they don't clear it far enough we get it right back Sergio Ramos puts it to AA nine skills and the finesse shot is in the back of the net it's two to zero and it's going to be a comfortable win over Wales now ladies and gentlemen in the comments down below I have a question for you guys does it really matter if someone plays on legendary or world class or amateur or semi pro or professional, does that make a difference? Does that make like your quality of play? If you're playing on legendary, does that make you a great player? Does that make you a legendary FIFA player? Because honestly, playing on legendary to me isn't that fun. You got to play like Barcelona. You got to hold the ball a lot. You got to play real defensive. You got to put your team on defensive. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down below. If someone plays on world class just because it's funner, is that a bad thing? If someone plays on legendary, does that make them a great player? I don't think it does. I know a lot of people who play on like world class, but they're great FIFA players. Y'all let me know. But stay tuned because in the next episode, England is next booyah hey the video is not done yet if you stayed for the end slate thank you i appreciate it and i quickly want to tell you some things about the channel real fast um now you know i'm playing on legendary so if you had that question hope i answer that for you um also this weekend i'm gonna have my setup video out so you guys want to see what my setup looks like and how wow i guess how my room is i got that setup video coming out this weekend for you guys um and tomorrow another episode of win one take one with england hopefully have a nice little storyline in the front to make the video more exciting and yeah, to the top right of the screen is yesterday's video. Go check that out if you haven't seen it yet. Hit that yellow button if you want to subscribe, if you enjoyed the content. Yeah, man, a like's always appreciated if you enjoyed it, but only if you enjoyed it. I'm your boy, Yay 9 skills and I will see you guys tomorrow when we face England.